Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Did a little mirror intro. I haven't done that before. Okay, so our apartment's a mess, but I'm starting this vlog off in a really fun way and opening a ton of packages. So let's go over there. Okay, I made a tripod out of my foam roller and we're just gonna go into the hall. So I'm gonna just go with what I'm most excited for. Um, so Casefy reached out and sent me a phone case and I'm pretty sure there's a mask in here. So I'm very excited about it. Um, but I picked out like the most cute phone case I've ever seen. So I'm very excited to see what they sent. Oh my gosh, they sent a white mask. Wow, cute. Except my makeup's gonna get all over that. Okay, what's this? I think these might be phone cleaners. Oh my gosh, it's a cleansing wipe for your phone. Wow, that's really, really nice. Okay, here's the phone case I got. This is my first ever phone case from Casetify, and I see so many people talking about them. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Wow. Okay, so I got this phone case that has clouds all over it so my phone case um the one that i was using before this is just a plain clear one from apple it's literally from apple take my phone case off now basically while well, i switch out my phone case for today's agenda i just have a lot of things to get done tomorrow i'm filming a summer redecorating video which you guys would have already seen before you see this vlog um but i'm just kind of getting the house cleaned and stuff to film that wish my uh phone screen wasn't so cracked but it's whatever um so that was my main focus today i've already done a little laundry what time is it it's like three o'clock it's almost three um so yeah i did a little laundry this morning and then um worked out i need to shower in like a desperate way what is going on with my phone oh well i really need to shower but i'm gonna do that later colin and i are making like homemade burger situation tonight um and homemade fun drinks that we've never made before it's like a grapefruit um refresher oh my gosh i'm having a hard time getting my phone in here okay there oh that's so cute i'm excited okay so here's my new phone case thanks to case to five and i'm excited about the cleansing wipes we're very excited about it if you want to twin me i'm like totally okay with that you should um, okay, next I'm gonna open up this package from Amazon. You guys would have already seen these, but now you get to see me open them um, when I was opening them before they were in the video. Um, this is some like decor books I ordered because I wanted to get books that had a neutral spine. It's my like hat super far forward on my face. Um, and I wanted to get hard covers because these are gonna be like display books. So I got this one book. Um, says live beautiful on the front and i like that they're both home decor books i feel like this is perfect and i like that it said live beautiful on the side because that's what people are gonna see i might actually read this though and then the other book i got is called abode and it says um it's about thoughtful living with less so um yeah i just thought that this was cool oh my gosh that's a dream on the back wow um so then when they're stacked it'll say um, live beautifully in a boat. So I thought that that was pretty cool. I did very good at picking those out, might I say, because I was ordering on Amazon and couldn't see them in person. But I'm actually excited to probably actually read both of those. And then, okay, we'll do something fun. So I was just at GNC and I was out of pre workout and protein, but then I decided to get a space case because it was basically less money and you got the multivitamin. Um, and so there were still like cases left to a surprise. I honestly would have thought that this would have been out by now. And when the space case came out, I never even got it. Because I was like, meh, I don't need that. But it comes with a shaker cup, protein, um, new pre-workout. And I haven't tried any of these flavors before, so I'm excited. Oops, they're kind of all over the place. Um, but it's the Galaxy Lemonade pre-workout, which I'm very excited about. Um, so this is just what it looks like. Galaxy Lemonade pre-workout and then oh my gosh the multivitamin is like really in there Here I'll just turn it sideways so you guys can see basically it just looks like this so it's um, Munchies protein multivitamin pre-workout and this really cute shaker cup so I'm excited about it I also picked up more greens this is the greens that we've been using um, 
back and forth between Alani New Greens, but the Amazing Grass Greens are really, really tasty. So I recommend either Alani New or Amazing Grass. I say that all the time, but in case you're new here. And then we went to Michael's and I picked up some wheat grass from Michael's, which you guys will also see in the video. But I'm about to make like that little display thing on our kitchen counter. And I also got this kind of grass. It's called Largus. Lagarus, Lagarus maybe? I don't even know. Sorry, I can't like pronounce things that aren't like normally pronounced right. And then I got some frames for these prints that I ordered, which you guys had also seen in the video. I'm just opening them here now for you. And then I got a can of spray paint because I'm gonna spray paint um, this vase I just got from Salvation Army, white instead of black because we know I'm a white girl. I love white decor, especially in this apartment. A lot of it's white. So I'm gonna go with the white color. And then if I wanna spray paint it black one day, I can re-spray re -spray paint it black. But anyway, I'm excited about my new phone case. I'm gonna make the arrangement that I just got all that stuff with clean up a little bit because now I've made a mess and continue on with whatever else happens. Hopefully washing my hair soon. trying to do some redecorating I I think I need to look on Pinterest for more inspo but I actually think I'm gonna leave this black and Colin kind of convinced me to leave it black um, but yeah and then also I probably need to like lay those beads out a little bit better and then I have this mirror but I also have this that just has a lot of stuff on it right now and then we also have this that I just use as like my shit dumping ground but I need to like clean that out so yeah we're gonna figure this out somehow and then I have this vase that used to be the holder of that but it can just kind of like sit somewhere and then I have this candle, this candle, I have another candle down here, this holds all my jewelry, yeah, I don't know, I need to Pinterest inspo, because that's, sometimes I just have a mental block, which is now, we're about to go to the ABC store and get liquor for our cute mixed drinks we're making, so here we go. Okay, we just went and ran and got the alcohol, and then I had another package, um, so I just got a package of Terra Origin Collagen, which Terra Origin's my all-time favorite collagen, because they have, um, like, multi-purpose collagen, so this is Collagen Skin Boost. Um, I got green superfoods to try those out. I got, um, Collagen Healthy Gut, and um, collagen bone broth protein. Actually, that's just bone broth protein, not collagen, but I got it in vanilla because I like that. Um, but healthy gut, oh my gosh, I seriously love it so much. And they sent me this, but you can get their stuff at Target if you're interested because it's so good, so good. So we're gonna make the drinks now and I'm gonna take pictures and stuff and do a little Instagram post from the drinks. I'm so excited. And we're using my new um, glasses that I got from Walmart. I'll have these linked let me turn this light on for lighting. I'll have these glasses linked down below in the picture, but they're so cute. I hauled them a couple videos ago. Will it focus? Yeah. So we're gonna use those and I'm excited. I will also have the recipe to this drink situation linked below, but it'll also be on my Instagram before you guys see this video. I just kind of like burped, sorry. Also, last time we were at Target, I just picked up a pair, a pair, a set of ultra soft, but it didn't really matter. Um, just a flat sheet. Uh, so main purpose of this is so I can hang it up behind me and take Instagram pictures and stuff. So I can have this link down below if you guys want to buy it. It's literally just a flat sheet because I didn't want to get the fitted one because I obviously don't need the fitted one. But I'm about to set this up because I'm going to take the pictures with the drinks with this behind it. So Colin's focusing on the drinks and I'm making my little 
picture display thing over here. Okay, here's my new sheet. It's nice and wrinkled, but you know, no one's perfect nowadays. Maybe before COVID, but definitely not after COVID. We've taken everyone's a mess to a whole new level. Am I right or am I right? Does this look terrible because it's so wrinkly? Probably. Literally, why is it that wrinkly? I have so far. Wait, our ice machine? I just need to fix it. I've fixed it before. We've got like quite the mess going on right here, but here's the grapefruit juice we used. Colin is doing an amazing job. An amazing job. Seriously, so good. I wish my clothes were in the background in our boxes. By the way, we have this um, bar kit from, oh my gosh, now I'm not gonna remember where it's from. Where is it from? Oh, where is this from? Oh, Crate and Barrel, and it's rose gold, and it's literally amazing. You've got your martini pour, you got a muddler, an ice scoop, so cute. My dad and his girlfriend got this for us for Christmas. It was like the best gift ever. Innovative. Okay, also, can I just say, Today is a good day. I'm just having a good day in general. But also, it's just like the little things. Set Active and the owner of Set Active, Lindsay Carter, both commented on my Instagram picture post today. And it's just like a fun feeling because they're like so cool. And I'm just like, wow, they saw my post and commented, you know? Okay, I gotta go stir a drink. Okay, I'm post full on photo shoot with our beverages. Oh, that's yummy. Mine's really yummy. I mentioned a few vlogs ago that I really wanted to do like a series on my Instagram. Um, I'm inspired by Alex Garza, but it's like summer cocktail drinks. Um, I also love Alex Garza. If you guys were wondering, she gives so much inspo. Her and her sister Frankie, her name's Francesca. I call her Frankie, but she is Francesca. But um, yeah, so I got this idea from them. I was like, oh, that would be so much fun because Colin and I love making drinks. Um, and then I was scrolling through Pinterest last night and I found this really cute, cute um, looking grapefruit refresher recipe, like I was telling you. Um, so this is what it looked like. I kind of drew inspo from this picture. But um, yeah, then I just laid it up all cute. So I'm excited to edit that while I drink this. Um, I bet I'm gonna end up showering like way later tonight because we got things to do. But I'm obsessed with these glasses so much. Oh, also tomorrow is the 4th of July, or in two days from now. What is today? I don't even know. A couple days from now, it's the 4th of July, so I just reminded myself I need to go reserve our spots at the pool, because that's how that works right now. It's reservation only and no guests. We're just going to have to bear with the fact today that I look absolutely stunning. <laughs> Baby hairs that have broken off. We're all good here. Um, okay, so, update. We made the drinks. I finished working for the day, so to call in, and now we're doing dinner, so... What was that? It was oh, we're air frying um, potatoes. Fry no, it's just scared me. I thought it was a fire alarm. Okay, so we're air frying potatoes. And then we also did zucchini squash. And then we're doing burgers. So I got, first of all, I'm obsessed with the Dave's Killer Bread. Like all types of Dave's Killer Bread. They're English muffins. They're regular bread. And so now I wanted to try out their buns. Um, and they're whole grain and seeds with protein. Omega-3 and no high fructose corn syrup. So it's like fabulous. So yeah, and then Colin's seasoning the potatoes with you're doing rotisserie chicken, aren't you? Yeah, I like it. Strange. <laughs> I've I mean, never heard of that. Tastes like rotisserie. I don't even know. It doesn't taste like rotisserie chicken. And then I seasoned the veggies with the Trader Joe's chili lime seasoning because that's so good. And those are in the oven at 425 for 20 minutes. We're rotating the potatoes. We're doing sauteed onions for the burgers, con sauteing mushrooms, so I don't eat mushrooms. And then we're doing the burgers. Um, we've made more drink. And yeah, that's dinner tonight. I'm excited about it. I'm also obsessed. Well, you guys have already seen it now, so I'll just show you in case you missed that vlog or that video I did of the redecorating, but definitely go watch it because I think it's gonna be really good, even though I haven't actually filmed it yet. I am just obsessed with the way this looks. I'm addicted to it. I'm so excited about it. And at blasting um, old, like, 2000s country music while we cook on Alexa. Alexa play, and it's been a good time. Here's dinner, so it, I, on my burger, I put um, sauteed onions, lettuce, tomato, and then my burger has cheese on it. And then we did these potatoes in the air fryer and then the veggies in the oven. And it looks really, really good. Now we're gonna, like, watch some TV a little bit before I shower, because that's important. But yeah, that looks quite tasty. Finally, washed my hair. 
it's now like 10 o'clock and it's taken me a couple hours to blow dry it but it's whatever i'm currently in my pjs my summer fridays chapstick right there did laundry earlier so i'm about to transfer my clothes to the dryer which is always the worst when you forget about it which i forgot about it just like taking you guys through a nighttime routine i like never show this part on the vlog for some reason probably because colin's in the shower right now but um anyways the routine is the pillows always go on the side of the bed on colin's side by the way my pajamas are from target but these sell out so fast so i always check the aisle um that they sell these in at target to see if they have new colors because they're literally snatched in like a minute it's not even funny so our whole like bed set is from target except we have um silk pillowcases and yeah just the pillowcases not the sheets yeah my side's the right side colin's side is the left side i've always slept ever since colin and i started like sleeping in the same bed i've always slept on the right he's always slept on the left and then i also wanted to point out like look at how much like better my skin is getting also my burn is like completely healed and i just feel like my skin is so much better I need it to set the alarm on my phone but basically my like nighttime skincare routine i put like my face lotion and stuff on the side of my bed um because i just like doing it sitting in bed is that weird i it's like a recent discovery that i like doing it sitting in bed but um i always put on my summer fridays jet lag mask and my summer fridays butter lip balm and i mix in some vitamin e oil with my face mask and i feel like my skin has gotten really really good in the past like two weeks like i'm blown away and then after that i just put on grande lash and whatever's left on the bristle i just put on my eyebrows so yeah that's like my little routine but i'm gonna do it and then and then colin will probably be done showering and we're gonna go to bed so i will see you guys in the morning morning so changed into my workout outfit for the day today's leg day so that is nice um obviously wearing set active colin told me today he's gonna clean up the clothes in his corner isn't that right and take the towel off the door i hate that isn't that right what? I'm right. About what? Everything. You're canceled. Um, okay, well, my phone password's all zeros. <laughs> right now, I'm just gonna scroll through Pinterest, and I always have my morning motivational quotes um, saved on my Pinterest board. They're also saved on the inspo highlight on my Instagram, but in case you ever just want to, like, come and get super inspired then I would, you know, check this out because there's literally so many. I have a ton. So, yeah. I'm going to do my morning little routine on Instagram with the motivational quote. I always do Monday through Friday. So today's the last day. But, yeah, all exciting things here. I'm going to get that done. And then make pre-workout. Oh, my God. I totally forgot. I get to try out the new space case pre-workout today. Fantastic. Okay, I'm making my pre-workout. So here's my little blender bottle. I could use the one that came in the set, but I'll just use my other one. Okay, so the pre-workout that comes in the space case is called Galaxy Lemonade. Ugh, I hate taking these top things off. Okay. I'm gonna do like a little smell test first. Mm. It smells pretty good. Whenever I use Alani new pre-workout, I just use like a heaping scoop. So it's like a little bit more than one scoop, but just like that much more, like not too much. So yeah, I'm just gonna give it like a little sip for the camera. Oh, hmm. Wow, that's really good. I don't even know, do you guys know, can you buy galaxy lemonade without buying us the space case or was it limited edition to the space case you guys don't know i'm obsessed with mimosa and arctic white lately i've always been getting mimosa because we just go to gnc for our alani new products um and they never have arctic white but they always have mimosa and so they didn't have mimosa this past time which is why i ended up purchasing the space case um 
but yeah that's really really good i'm about to go check on their website and see the verdict for if you can buy it online but i heard that gnc's are like going bankrupt or something and closing so we might have to start ordering anyway is that true or was that a rumor or was that like fake news i don't know we are back from working out and i'm currently making our post-workout shake but we're gonna try out the munchies protein too munchies not munchies munchies what am i saying i don't even know okay here's the smoothie it looks exactly the same because it is exactly the same. <laughs> I think I like the fruity cereal one better. I really like blueberry muffin and confetti cake. This one's good though. It just kind of, I don't know, it's just not my favorite, but it's still good. And now we're going to drink it until it's gone. So it's good enough to drink until it's gone. I just think I like fruity cereal better. Okay, I've gotten ready, and I'm getting ready to film my home decor video, but like I said, you guys have already seen it. I'm just now filming it. Also, okay, tell me if you've gotten lip injections or lip filler. First of all, is it the same thing? Because I honestly don't know. That's something I should Google. I feel like it is, but, um, and if you liked it, and or if it was just like a waste of money, because lately I've just been like really wanting to try it out. I just like I know I don't need it but I've just been like feeling like I want to because I just do so let me know and then we'll like cross that path whenever the time comes but I'm gonna get ready and film this video so I have time to edit it and upload it before tonight because we're going on a double date with my best friend Kara and her fiance Adam so we're excited we're going to Tupelo Honey um I'll probably end up like changing outfits and stuff too but yeah I'm gonna begin filming here so I can stay on schedule just finished recording that video i am literally winded i need so much water right now um by the way my shirt is from revolve and these are cotton on jeans and i wear a size four and small from revolve if you're wondering but i'm about to edit that because i told you guys i was uploading it today i completely forgot to thaw chicken yesterday or earlier today i guess i could have done either um i'm also snacking on these like sweet potato chips they're like whole grain sweet potato tortilla chips they're pretty yummy I forgot to thaw chicken for lunch, so all of our meat's pretty much frozen. So I have a um, pack of chicken out on the patio, um, baking in the sun, basically. Um, so hopefully that finishes up so we can make lunch, because I'm quite hungry. And Kara and Adam aren't getting um, to, the, well, we are have a restaurant reservation, a reservation at the restaurant at 6.30, and it's just now three, so I feel like if I make like a small lunch, I will be hungry for dinner for sure. So for lunch today, I was craving Chipotle, but then I just decided my chicken did thaw. So I was now transitioning into making my own at-home Chipotle bowl, and I thought it'd be fun anyway to do that together. So yeah, my video is uploading to YouTube, so I'm just going to start cooking, and it probably won't even take that long. So Okay, so oh, one more thing got rice too but I'm only gonna use it just a little bit of the rice and I'll put the rest in Tupperware and then I'm gonna heat up the stove and start doing the chicken I'm gonna put avocado oil down I have the chicken already cut up and stuff I just had it thawing out in the sink a little bit more in like a whole thing of hot water the chicken's going I'm gonna put the rice in the microwave then my base of my bowl is just gonna be romaine lettuce that I got from the grocery store Okay, this rice from Trader Joe's is so good. I'm obsessed with it. And then we're just going to put it all in the container. I just have a Tupperware. And then scoop. Then some rice. Whew. And then I'll save this rice and use some more like tomorrow or something for lunch. And I got my chicken. Nice. This is like the main part of my bowl and then on top. I'm just gonna put a little bit of sour cream Like seriously not a lot at all. Just a little bit because why not? Won't hurt Just like drizzle sour cream Perfect. Okay. Well, that's just gonna go into the bowl. It's Friday. I can eat dairy on a Friday We're going out to eat tonight if you're trying to do dairy free, I would suggest not putting sour cream in it and then vegan cheese But we are out of vegan cheese right now so I'm 
falling out because it's a Friday. I just feel like everything's in moderation and limiting yourself is just unrealistic and not very fun and I get really burnt out when I limit myself a lot. I think once I start my like shredding for the wedding series, it'll be a whole nother story because I have like a very large goal that I'm working towards. But that video is starting right after um, like mid July. I'm gonna start like early August. I'm also putting a little bit of cilantro on top for taste because I just love cilantro. I guess I'll mix it all together with my spoon and then grab a fork. But here's what it looks like before I mix it. It's super plain and I know like people get a lot of other stuff in their Chipotle bowls, but I was kind of limited with what I was working with today. So yeah, I mean, you could add like onion in there. You can add tomato, pico situation. Um, pico, by the way, if you want to make pico at home, it's just um, diced onion, diced tomatoes and lime juice. So really easy. Okay, switching to a fork. Then I need to go link all of those home decor pieces or get the links and put them in the description box of the video. Okay, so I've changed outfits. Here's my dinner date night look. I'm wearing these shorts. Oh, my whole outfit's from Princess Polly again. <laughs> but um, it's not a romper or anything. It's like a shirt and shorts. And then I'm just wearing these heels that I always wear. So yeah, that's my little outfit. I just wanted it to be really comfy. I know my shorts are like super wrinkly, but we don't have a steamer or an iron. So that's what I'm wearing. I've just been watching TikToks for like the past, I don't even know how long. Adam, well, you've been in the vlog because I told them, I showed them you when you were a bridesmaid box. Oh, yeah, yeah. Date night in the city. Good morning guys. So last thing you saw was when we went to dinner with Kara and Adam. I got a quick vlog clip in before we, everyone put their masks on and I like didn't have that many things in my hands. But um, now it's currently Sunday. Yesterday was 4th of July. And yeah, we're getting ready to head to Trader Joe's. I got ready for the day just because I didn't do like any work stuff yesterday. So I was planning on like kind of working with some Instagram pictures today so I can like stock up for the week ahead and then stock up for the next week. So yeah, that's the plan today. And just kind of getting some work done and then we're having a sushi sundae. To our first stop of the day. Gone. He stole my case. To she gave it to me. He stole I didn't my even mask. ask or anything like that. She said, You can wear it because I'll get makeup all over it and it's all white. But I want to wear it when I'm not wearing makeup. Mm -hmm. Okay. I have this Mickey Mouse one still. Okay, we're home. We're gonna do a Trader Joe's haul for you guys. So uh, we picked up some more spinach. This was just like a lot of restock for smoothie stuff. I got like blackberries, two huge things of strawberries, almond butter. This is literally my new favorite milk. Um, bananas. Got two things of baby avocados because they're perfect for smoothies. These are like my literal favorite chips ever. Um, this pizza is really good too if you just like want a snack on the weekend or something. Colin and I ate it yesterday and I was very impressed. So I got another one. And then I got chia seeds, flax seeds. Um, trying out this vegan kale cashew and basil pesto because I will, you know, like whenever I make pasta and stuff, I can put it on that. And then I also got buffalo style chicken dip thinking we could kind of snack on this today. So yeah, there's like a little overview, not a huge grocery shop. I actually have three HelloFresh meals coming this week. So we have leftover chicken and some meat and potatoes and stuff. So we really didn't need to get anything for meals because we did a really good job of shopping last week, but I just needed a few more things. So I'm gonna put this away, make a smoothie, and then I don't know after that, to be honest, work, I guess. I had every intention of having a very, very productive day today. But then I was just like really tired for some reason and just wasn't really feeling it. So I was like, meh, whatever. I just have a lazy Sunday. So that's pretty much what I did. I'm in this really cute tie-dye set from uh, Colors by Stuff on Instagram. She sent it to me and it's super cute. Um, and we just picked up the sushi and we pretty much watched movies and I online shopped and just added a bunch of stuff to my cart but didn't buy anything so yeah it was like a pretty good Sunday um but I'm gonna um upload this video tomorrow so I figured I should just end it now Colin's making us homemade mojitos so I can have that recipe and the other drink I made in this vlog down below in case you guys want to make them but also the other ones on my Instagram and I'm gonna be putting this one on my Instagram in a couple weeks 
So in case you want to go back and reference it, it'll be coming. But yeah, I'm going to end the vlog. I'm patiently waiting for Katie Hearn to have her baby. And that's about it. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you're subscribed. If you're not already subscribed, stick around. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.